Welcome back. Plenty of college students are looking ahead to the fall semester and wondering what is it going to look like? Well, at Delgado Community College, they are striving to keep students and faculty safe while still maintaining their academic integrity. Joining us now this morning with a look ahead to the fall semester, please help me welcome Ms. Michelle Greco. She is the Director of Enrollment Management. First things first, Michelle, welcome to the show. Thank you. Thank you for having us. Delgado is excited to be a part. Yes, you know, my mom is a proud alum of Delgado, so I'm glad to be talking to you all. Thank you so much for everything that you're doing to help out these incoming students and returning students. I know the enrollment process for college can be very overwhelming, especially since we're going through a pandemic right now. How is Delgado adapting to help with the enrollment process for incoming students? Yeah, you know, um, like you said, coming to college for the first time can be really exciting, but also a little scary. So we have our orientation programs. Uh, we ha are doing those virtually and we're having them on Thursdays. And during our orientation program, you'll get to, you know, meet some of our staff through Zoom. Uh, you'll also get to meet our advisors. You'll get to meet financial aid counselors and admissions counselors. Um, we also are providing some one-on-one -on -one appointments face-to-face uh, -face appointments at City Park campus right now. So if a student does want some one-on-one -on -one time with an enrollment counselor, we certainly are allowing for that, um, you know, masks up and behind plexiglass. Um, but we also, at any time, you know, Monday through Thursday, 8 a, uh, 7.30 a.m. to 6 p.m., we are offering a live chat at dcc.edu too. So that's a great opportunity if you just have any questions, you know. Um, we also have a lot of um, Chew and Chats events going on right now, which is just like jump into Facebook with us or um, subscribe to the, the Zoom account, and we'll go ahead and give you some hints on how to come to college. We'll also um, write down some of our programs for you in about a 20-minute little, I uh, guess, webinar, you know? Resources, adapting and using your resources. I love that. I also love something that you all did this summer. You all did a first time award for incoming students who enrolled in the summer. Is there anything that you can tell us happening in the fall as far as this award money? Yeah, we're really excited. We're launching our Think 30 Award this fall, um, and it's available to any student who registers before July 15th and enrolls in 15 credit hours or more. Um, so the Think 30 initiative just is there to remind students that you need 15 hours a semester to stay on track with your education. It'll help you save money and it increases your chances of graduating on time. So Think 30 with us this, uh, this fall and earn $600. Graduate on time. That's a big goal for a lot of people. Now let's talk about the classes. You know, I know Delgado's summer classes were pretty much all online. What types of classes are you all going to be doing as we move into this upcoming fall semester? Sure. Um, we'll have our, our regular modalities, uh, our class types, right? We'll have our face-to-face -face class types. We'll have online classes. Um, we'll also have our hybrid classes. But this semester, we're also going to be doing a few new um, classroom types. Um, one is called virtual live classes. And so these are classes that you will sign up for Monday at 8 o'clock, Wednesday at 8 o'clock, and Friday at 8 o'clock. Um, you'll jump into our online um, teaching software, Canvas, or Zoom, and you'll actually be communicating with your professors and your classmates at that day and time, but through the computer, right? Online um, and virtually. Uh, so that'll be uh, one of our modalities. The other is a hybrid virtual live class. And so in our hybrid model, students attend class one day a week on campus. In our hybrid virtual live model, that one day a week would be online or virtually. Um, the that. other, yes, it's so 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 convenient, you know. And we see these as really just like steps to the future. A lot of people are very, um, they're busy, right? We have lots to do. We're juggling kids. We're juggling work. Being able to to expand on some of these virtual models, I think, will really help, you know, all of us in the future. And what's also going to help out people at Delgado and, of course, in the future is that not only are you taking precautions inside the classroom, but outside the classroom as well. What are some of the precautions you all are taking outside the classroom? And tell us quickly, we have one minute left. 
All right, sounds good. Um, so we are doing, you know, plexiglass and masking, things that you'll normally see around. Um, the main thing that's different about, I think, the classroom is we're redesigning those classrooms to fit uh, everybody six feet apart, but we'll also be capping those class sizes at 50% capacity. Um, other than that, you'll see the typical things you're seeing and other, so other um, you know, restaurants or businesses that you'll visit. Genius, my friend. Well, look, thank you so much for adapting. You know, college is very important, and I'm glad that you all are adapting to your resources. I appreciate you, Michelle, for coming on the show today. And of course, if you want to know how you can apply to go to Delgado Community College, please visit their website. Just log on to dcc.edu or give them a call at 671-5000.